Alright, episode 6 of my uh, Road King game series is upon us. Um, just going to jump into a match. Uh, kind of got smacked around last episode. Um, hopefully don't get smacked around that bad this time. But, um, yeah, I made a fur hire deck. I grinded up to get some packs. Well, I actually bought some too. Just bought some packs with real money. Um... I have a feeling I might need to use that deck at some point. Um, but, um. Yeah. So. We'll see. I've been playtesting play that on, um. On Yugi, not Yami Yugi. Um. So. Which it's. I don't really have that many, um. Uh. Anyways, but um, so I'd probably use them on Yami here, U use that deck, but, but um, and let's see here, great, my connection sucks right now here, let me turn the Xbox off, that's probably, uh, that's probably some of it, um, it's probably a lot of it, but um, that should get better here in a second, I think I'm gonna, I'm not gonna attack that. I prob probably could have gone exemplar here, but um, all right. Um, I'll go alchemist probably next turn. I just want some some uh, firepower here, just to see what the heck this man is throwing down. All right. Well, we got two pretty good cars face down. I don't know, we're just kind of kind of moving along here. All right, get evil swarm, sir. So, yeah. I really don't want to use my wall here, but I think that's what I'm going to do, and then maybe chain my dust tornado. Okay, so I win next turn. Yeah. Yeet yeet. Oh my god. Alright, well we win. We're gonna I think we're gonna win that turn anyways. Um Alright, starting off this uh this episode with a win. <laughs> we're just getting all draw since low level. Actually, Anyways, alright, started with the win, let's go. Hop into another one. Um, don't get the uh, satisfaction of finishing them off with an attack, but, you know, whatever, I'll take it. Um, that was pretty straightforward right there. I don't know why he put those couple of monsters in defense mode, but, um, so, I don't know. Anyways, we get a win was kind of not really paying attention, kind of distracted, so, um, alright, 30 cards, his life point boost, okay, he was, he threw me off there for a second, he was running everything Joey, and uh, all of a sudden it's a Yu-Gi life point boost, what, anyways, let's see what this man is running here, Hopefully it's not a bunch of 1900 beaters or an Amazon stack. But um, okay, he just ends his turn. So I don't know what that means. Um, I'm just gonna go straight forward here with my silent magician. Um. Oh yeah. Okay, so 
1500 attack points, two enemy controllers, um, I think I'm pretty safe to do that, and I'll summon Alchemist, um, you know, next turn, um, get another spell counter, and, uh, run it! So, we'll see what happens, we'll see what he does here. Does he just have a ton of spell and trap cards, or a bunch of monsters? He, um, uh, I'm just gonna attack, I think. Um, just give as much life point damage as possible. Um, I mean, I have two enemy controllers, so what's the burst that he can do to me? And I just whittle down his attack points here. Is he trying to get like Exodia or some shit? Is that why he's just kind of chilling? Um, or he just has a bunch of high level monsters and spell trap cards that he doesn't want to set and or use. Um, I'm kind of confused here. But at least you would think you would set something if you just have spell and trap cards. Like, you know, either to bluff or, I don't know, just do something instead of just ending your turn two times in a row. Or is he just trying to derank, so... I, I really don't know what this man is trying to do right here, or wants to do, or has, or... Okay, here we go, some... Oh, he's an Air Mage. Alright. But you don't get an extra summon. I mean, you don't want to take all that life point damage if you're... Um, an Air Mage, because you... Uh, I'm sorry, I was trying to look out the window there, but... Um, you're... Uh, you know, it's kind of pointless. You can't use their effects. Okay, what? Okay. So, 400 attack points. I, I don't understand. You're gonna lose next turn anyways. So, if... What the heck? This is the weirdest air mage, or he's just running a bunch of plant stuff together. Like I, I don't understand what this man is doing. I'm gonna check his deck after this, cause this is weird, man. Um. All right. So he had something that could have been activated there. Um. I mean, I'm just gonna activate. Um, the effect to get another spell counter here, in, in case something goes weird here. I know if I just attacked, I win, but, um, ah. Yeah, that's only if it attacks, bruh. I'm gonna destroy it before it attacks. You just wasted that, and I still win, I think. Yeah. Alright, yes, one more card you can activate here. Is it an enemy can... Oh, come on. I want to see what this man does. Reconnect him, please. Thank you. Um, Astral Barrier. <laughs> what? So you're gonna... <laughs> okay? check this man's deck to see what what kind of like, <laughs> what the fuck <laughs> hey but we're moving up gold rank let's go all right what was this man doing all right so he had he had some sylvans he had some air mages 
So the carrot weights go with the Sylvans. See, this is why people, ah, crap, only really run the, the uh, carrot weights, um, this one, Guardi Oaks, and Hermitries. You get a lot of useless junk. Um, and then, two Aroma Gardens. I guess this man just got a bunch of junk that he couldn't summon. I mean, what, he has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven monsters he can't summon, but, um, without a sacrifice. I don't know, that's why you also run, um, what's it called, uh, Rose Lover, so you can, um, you know, special summon. I don't know. That man almost had it. That's why you don't want to run 30 card decks. I have to say that this man's running a 30 card deck. Um, I just might go Heavy Silent Magician here. Five fusion monsters. I would like to get. Well, actually, yeah, because I can stop that with um, Silent Magician here. We'll see what I draw. I would like to draw a backline card. Enemy control. Enemy controller, wall disruption, something. Yeah, we'll see. Okay. Nice. Alright, just what I wanted. <laughs> Hell yeah. Alright, so I don't think that's an enemy controller. Or a wall. Since it looked like he might have been able to... Thousand attack points, wall disruption. I can stop all of the spell cards. Um, yeah, we'll see what's up. I don't think he could have activated. But. All right. So um, yeah, we'll see what he plays. I can stop all of his spell cards, and then I can wall if he. Destiny draws, okay. So he's gonna get what he wants here. Um, but again, I can stop all spell cards. I can wall something if he gets something out. Um, ah. Aha. Ooh, what the hell? Alright, well, I get my... Um, Uh, hold on. Give me a sec. So I, 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 hold on. Um. Shit. I'm gonna go for it. Though I think that trap card might fuck me up here. Um. At the end of your opponent's turn. Okay. That doesn't activate in the... Okay. I guess he destiny draw a trap card, or he might have. But um, here, does he have anything? No, he just had two of them. Okay. Um. He doesn't have anything that can. I think I just went here. Yeah. Alright, nice. That got tacky there for a second. I forgot that that thing could um, destroy spell and trap cards when you uh, yeah, summon it. But, um, alright. 
getting some dubs. Getting some dubs. Been relatively quick matches today. Okay. I haven't seen too many people using Esperoba, so uh, we'll see what he wants to do. I haven't really faced a psychic deck. Kind of outside of the AI. Oh, what does that do? Good thing I get to go second here. <laughs> um, probably just gonna level up. Depending on what he plays, I'm probably just gonna level up. And, uh,. Hope that's not a um alright. I don't think Okay. Um Is that a floodgate? Uh because I mean I could um here. I'm just gonna do it. Uh I don't think it was a floodgate because it would have um, hitched right there. Uh, you know, the game would have paused to let him activate it if he wanted it to. So, um. If it's a spell card, doesn't matter. If it's a wall, it doesn't matter. Well, it will matter, but I'd still destroy him. Um. Yeah, nice. Nice! Um. I'm glad you used it then because I still have 2700 attack points. Instead of next turn when I'm gonna have two monsters out. But um that's fine. That's fine with me. Um it's not Okay. Yeah, I think I wanna get my Kaiku out next turn so I can um Oh, during the next standby phase. Damn. Okay. Hopefully I draw something decent here. But I don't think my, um, hold on, does he have to tribute for that? Oh, yeah, just pay life points. Okay. But he shouldn't be able to summon something that's going to have more than 2,200 tech points. There we go. Okay. So we're going to summon Kaiku here. Now, if he has another wall, what's the... That's not a wall. Oh, never mind, sorry. I, does he have another wall disruption? Um, I guess we'll find out. Bruh! Are you serious, man? Are you serious? Are you fucking serious, man? Or he has two wall disruptions within how many cards is that? Like, are you kidding me? Is that a th okay? We'll see what he does. I was gonna say, is that a third one? Jesus Christ, man! I'm gonna fucking lose right here. I'm gonna fucking lose because he got two wall disruptions. God bless America, dude. I knew it. I knew it. I knew I should have just attacked once, man. Should have just attacked fucking one or not, just summoned. Just not even summoned anything. I knew it. I knew it. I shouldn't have summoned a goddamn thing, dude. Oh, that's fucking annoying. He has two wall disruptions. Instantly, man. Ugh. That's so fucking annoying. He was probably running three, wasn't he? Yeah, three and a mirror wall and two super rushes. Jesus fucking Christ, man. So, four wall cards and two super rushes. So, he had six cards. I hate decks like that, man. You literally can't do anything. Of course, you know, I don't have 
my dust tornado and my own wall. Like, if I had my own wall right there, I'm still in it. He gets two of them. Get none. That's fucking annoying. And he has two super rushes. Oh my god. I had that gut feeling too. I was like, don't summon anything. Just attack. But then again, I mean, then I just would have given him nothing. See, that's why I didn't use my silent burning either. Because I didn't want to give him more cards. Because look at it. He had, you know, all of those that could have just fucked me. That is super annoying, man. What? Is Kaiku... I know he's gonna destroy me right here, but I kinda wanna get this off the fucking field. I, knew, I mean, I know he was gonna do that, but I'm not gonna waste the uh, summon. I'm just level four for that. And hell, he might have destroyed something else. So, like, he, like this, this turn. Safe this turn, and um, yeah. Oh, nice. Okay, good. We'll get it this turn. That's fine with me. Um, See what he has lurking face down. I need to destroy a monster here so he can't su uh, summon a level 7 or above next turn. Is, is that a second one? I want to be slightly upset. I want to be slightly upset. What is this man trying to do? Boxer. God damn it. I knew it was going to be a man eater bug, man. destroy this man eater bug right now and have him take a lot of it. No, I'm just gonna set. I mean he can't flip it face down again so I'm gonna wait. I mean he can't destroy me with boxer so. The only way he can flip that face back face down is if he has a book of moon. I think. Is that it? One of those books or is it a book of Taiyu. Taiyu. Yeah, uh, you know, the one that sucks with the T. I can't remember. One of those. One of those book cards. Okay, well. I guess we got bailed out by that. Um, I'm going to do one more. I don't want to end on that. That's kind of a cheesy way to end it, I think. Um, let's see, what was he doing? Said a bunch of random shit. He had two mini bugs though. 
Super Rush, enemy controller. Get up floodgate. Damn. He had more spell and trap cards than monsters. Bruh. There's a bunch of 1800 beaters. And then, see that's what I was afraid of. I didn't know he had a Jinzo. So he had three things he couldn't even summon. What is... Okay, so I didn't have to be worried about that. You can special summon an earth monster, but the only earth monsters he had were man eater bugs and that. Anyways. Interesting, man. We'll do Unamas. Win or lose. Italy. Italy is an amazing country. Was there for three weeks. Two months ago, I think now. It was in May. Basically, three, week, three weeks in the middle of May. Best three weeks ever. Definitely recommend if you, if anyone wants to travel to go to Italy, an amazing place. Though not really if you only know English, but um, you know, I know quite a bit of Spanish, so that helped. You know, the stuff is somewhat the same. But um. I think I'm gonna have to grind to get another wall. Or, well, you know. Grind to get some stuff to open up some packs. Definitely has something that can be activated. Let's see what he does. We can activate something right here. Does he have a C stealth yeah, C stealth attack? He probably does. Might uh, I might I didn't think of that. And that's what uh, that's what you run with this type of deck, man. Shit. See stealth attack. But, uh, I might have actually wanted to run an exemplar here instead. But then again, if he doesn't really get anything with this draw. Did he even draw a card? Oh yeah, it did. Okay, whoa, for a second I was like, wait a minute, is it my turn again? <laughs> I realized it took that long to, to end my turn, but... Okay. You know, whatever. Really, I think his entire hope landed on that draw. Just, if, if this go, if this works, um, if this works, I should be able to win next turn. Metal Morph! Everybody is running Metal Morph now, man. Let's not run C Stealth Attack. Let me just run Metal Morph so we see. I, I, mm, I'll probably still die here. Actually. Nope. We, uh. Is he trying to activate something else?
Oh, the Metal Morph did work. Why did it only take a- Oh, yeah, that's right, because it adds points. Whatever, I'll just mess them up next turn. Okay, enemy control and Metal Morph. Um... At least he used both of those cards um, right then. So he only has one card in his hand and whatever he draws this turn. Um, so, man, we're only on turn five. Damn connection issues. Okay, my turn, we win. Um, 2,700 points, yep. Alright, we're gonna end this one on a victory. Alright, well, <laughs> as I say, I might want to change up my deck, or, you know, what deck I'm using. We go, what, 4 and 1 today? Not bad. Um, I don't think I get to rank up here, though, so sad face, but, um, yep. Hopefully, maybe next win we'll, uh, um, rank up. I just want to see. So, this man did not... Okay, he did have... But doesn't he need... He doesn't even have that card. Why does he have it in this deck? He doesn't even have a sea stealth attack. Anyways, um... Yeah, uh, we've gone on a long time now, but um, yeah, we won a lot of duels today. Stay winning. <laughs> Next episode is probably going to be the exact opposite. So um, yeah, thank you for watching and check out my um, my pack op opening videos and if you um, you know enjoyed this one and um, see you next time.